Harper off the plate. 3-2 pitch to Coleman. Strike three call. One away. One hop soft liner and catch wound up with runners at to the back, to throw to second. They'll have to tag him, and they do for the double play to end the inning. Greenberg looks in. Got the sign from Bardwell. Now the 0-1 pitch. Grounded back to the pitcher. Pitcher knocks it down. It's going to be fielded by the shortstop. Only plays at first. Gets Martinet by a step. A couple of right-handers throwing. Roberts looks to second, it's hit to left field. That ball's going to dump in. It's going to be fielded by LeBeck. The throw toward the plate is going to be safe. Just got in as Melendez. Nice slide around at home, home plate, and he scores on the single for LaBella. Fordham. Wildcats with four. There's a drive to right field that's going to get down. That's going to be trouble all the way to the warning track. One run will score. Here comes the second run. He will score. The throw will be to third, and it's going to be a triple. It's 3-2 to two in favor of Fordham as Tara Beck and LaBella come home to score on the triple by McKenzie. Two balls, two strikes. And just sort of a rusty gate swing there as he is striked, struck out for a second time. So 0 for 3 for Coleman. And Martinet awaits. Pitch struck him out, swinging. Bazin got the single. 1-0. Didn't mean to, tapped it back to the mound. Looks to second, fires, throw back to first. He's got him for the double play. Martinet, just out of frustration, takes his helmet and both hands to the ground. Tough, didn't mean to, tapper. And the Wildcats are retired on the double play. A lot of double plays today. For the most part, a pitching duel, but errors figured into a number of the runs today. 5-2, to two, the final score. Fordham with the win over the Davidson Wildcats. We're here with senior Ben Greenberg of the Fordham baseball team following the Rams' 5-2 win over the Davidson Wildcats on Saturday. Ben, uh, a big bounce-back game for the Rams after last night's loss. You know, what did you guys do today to, to come away with the win? I think, I mean, we competed at the plate a little bit harder. Uh, we put together better, better at bats. Um, you know, we're right in every game. Uh, it's all about that timely hit, timely play. Uh, we've been in every game this year, and I, I think if we can put together good bats, we'll, we'll have a shot. Seven strong innings from yourself today, but weather was certainly a factor as the game moved on there. How, how were you able to stay focused e even though the weather kept changing? It seemed like every inning toward uh, the fifth, sixth, and seventh innings there. Yeah, I mean, my, my cleats were getting a little, a little filled up on the mound, but um, I, I, I think if, I need to, if I'm going to be good, I need to compete. I need to have energy on the mound, and hopefully that, that fires up my, my fielders behind me, and then we have good at-bats, and uh, just a lot of energy I think will help, and uh, not letting the weather affect me, affect me too much. We're here with sophomore shortstop Matt Terebeck of the Fordham Rams following the Rams 5-2 win over Davidson. Matt, pick up your uh, first career four-hit game as you get splashed right there. It's a little, little cold today to get splashed like that, but four big hits today. Uh, you guys come away with a big win. You know, what was the difference between today and, and yesterday where you guys had a tough game? You know, I thought uh, Coach Layton said before the game, he said, you know, get on the plate, uh, try to take the inner half away from the a slow lefty there, and uh, I thought we did that today, later in the game especially, but uh, once we did that, I thought we, we got some big hits from uh, Jake, Alvin got on from that era over there, and then uh, we were able to score. Today, uh, the, the younger players come up big. You mentioned Jake coming up with a big two-run triple, LaBello get the bases low to walk in the RBI single earlier. You know, what type of confidence does that give you guys in the lineup that all the young players, yourself only a sophomore, are coming through with big hits uh, as we start 8 10 Oh, players. yeah, it's huge. I think for a uh, freshman and sophomore to be stepping up like that, I mean, that's all you can ask for. Uh, but we knew coming in we didn't have an older team, but uh, I think what we're working with so far, we're doing pretty well with it. So. Well, congratulations on the big win today and the four-hit game, Matt. Appreciate it. Thank you.